para la mamá. Standing in front of some of the most fertile soil in the state of California that have been farmed for generations. And the city council had made a decision that they were going to look at annexing this property um, for housing and commercial development. This is at a time when we have ample housing for people in our community. And so to really, to look at taking farmland, farmland that has fed people and, and nurtured people for generations, and turn it into houses and cement and roads just didn't make any sense. The Santa Barbara County Action Network approached the EDC about you know, representing us in a lawsuit against the city of Lompoc. After numerous um, settlement hearings, the city of Lompoc chose to settle with SB Can and the Environmental Defense Center to the benefit of all of us. The thing that I like best about the Environmental Defense Center, not just now with this, with this case, but over the years, is that they didn't look at who had the most money or who had the most power. They consistently looked at the issue. Is this a valid issue? Is this something that they should be involved in? And they consistently chose the ones that would truly make a difference. There's not a lot of farmland left. There's not a lot of open space left. We have to hang on to it. And without the Environmental Defense Center, we wouldn't be able to.